All right, this is day three of the dig. It's Wednesday, and we're still in the same square. We uh, thought the bedrock was going to be a little less deep than it turned out to be, so we dug around it here at the edge, you can see, and found some rocks. Um, if we look down in there, that could possibly be a wall. We don't know for sure. We're still looking. And then we got uh, some what looks like rubble over here in this corner, so. We'll see what that ends up being. Earlier on today we had a little bit of a stir. We found some pottery lying directly on the bedrock, which uh, means that since nothing can be under bedrock, those pottery pieces can date this entire square. So that was a big deal, and they came by and took lots of pictures of it and dressed it up like it was a Hollywood rock star, and that was very nice. This is Thomas. Thomas is helping out with the uh, software on the dig and doing a survey right now. Say hi, Thomas. Hi. Hi. And uh, this is Roland. Hi, Roland. Roland's from Germany. He helps out in our square Austria. when he... Austria. Yeah, Austria, sorry. Austria. Uh, which is cooler because that's where Mozart's from and Beethoven and they're cool. And uh, he helps out in our square when he doesn't have anything else to do. And what is your job exactly, Roland, on the dig? I am painting uh, top lights. Okay, what does that mean? Um, we have a separate bucket for the... Have a look. They're allowing a line around. Oh, okay. All right. So. The supervisors get them in the morning. They like a plan of. Oh, okay. All right. So Roland helps us out on the dig, but when he's got nothing to do, he he digs in our square, which is fun. I like Roland. And then, oh, well, everybody else is over here. Their rubble has uh, increased in size. You can see. Looks like they've. Got what looks like maybe a wall going on there. Okay, so are these the last two buckets? Something with over there, and uh, this wall has turned into quite a mess. It could possibly be curved. They don't know if that was intentionally or not. Uh, earlier today, we had a, an unusual find. Uh, we found a seal, and this is uh, Dr. Klingbeil. He's our expert in seals, and uh, so he was looking at it earlier. That was pretty cool. And we head on over here. You can see these squares have gotten quite a bit deeper. They've started to find some rubble in Travis's square. I don't know uh, what that flag is, but I haven't heard uh, of anything exciting coming out from over here. You guys have anything exciting happen in your square, Tony? Uh, we've actually found two coins there today. Oh, one that's was, cool. One was a small Persian, one was a big Roman, and we found a bit of Roman glass. Oh, neat. And we seem to think, see this part right here, this center right here, we okay. think is part of that wall that's over in Joel. Court. Yeah, that makes we sense. Think that's a corner. And then right over here, we feel like this may or may not be something that's connected with the cultic center that was found last year. Oh, okay. Down on the edge. But we don't know for sure. We're just trying to move it. But Travis says this that rock right there in the middle is just too big to not be something. Yeah, I'm with so, you there. So we don't know what's going on. But uh, potential. That's potential. Cool. It's only day awesome. three. That's right. It's only day three. And then over here, we got uh, a wall. And uh, I don't know. Completed. 10% of our time. Are we doing okay <laughs> Hey, John. Hey. What happened in your square today? Oh, all sorts of great stuff. We're uncovering two walls. I see that. Um, so we any idea what that big, huge stone is yet? Uh, I think we think it's just part of a wall. Okay. Pretty just sure it's a not some big sort of... stone. Should I just yeah. go and dump this, John? Yeah. yeah. All right, so that's day three. Uh, we're making progress here. We're getting somewhere. Feels like it. We're not just... Looking at bare earth now, which is fun. So, anyway, this is me signing.